So the 2021 NFL season has been underway for about two days now, and one of the big events coming up is free agency, which is starting on March 17th. The New York Jets have $68 million, which is second most among all NFL teams, and could have around $85 million with cuts. So, the New York Jets will be making a big splash in free agency this offseason. And we already have some rumors of players the New York Jets could be interested in resigning as well as signing. So, let's get right into those rumors. But before we get started, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. Let's me know if you are appreciating the videos I'm making around here. So, without further ado, let's get started. Alrighty, so according to Connor Rogers, the New York Jets will be looking to sign Marcus May to a long term extension. But if they cannot come to an agreement, we will most likely franchise tag May. Shouldn't come to a shocker, as you New York Jets general manager Joe Douglas said at his end of season press conference, that re-signing Marcus May is going to be one of his top priorities. May's even said he wants to be in New York long term. But if the two cannot come to an agreement, which I think is very unlikely, the franchise tag number for safety this offseason is going to be around $10 million. The New York Jets will also be interested in Juju Smith-Schuster and Will Fuller. They're actually going to be at the top of a free agent list, according to Jeremy Fowler of ESPN. The New York Jets will also be looking into guys like Zach Paschal as second-tier options. So it sounds like we're going to be interested in the yards after catch receivers. And, I mean, this doesn't shock me. Uh, Kyle Shanahan and the 49ers ran a yards after catch type of offense. I mean, think about it. George Kittle, Debo Samuel, Brandon Ayuk, some massive yards after catch gainers. And we know Michael Floor, Robert Sala bringing over that Kyle Shanahan 49ers offense to the New York Jets. So the fact that we're going to be interested in some big yards after catch guys doesn't come to a shocker as me. Although I'm really not interested in these guys. I would rather us go after Allen Robinson. I mean, if they're going to fit the system well then, you know, you do you. Uh, also, Curtis Samuel is also going to be a guy the New York Jets are going to be interested in. You know, I reported that a couple of days ago. He's also another fast yards up to catch receiver as well. So, Jets are going to be interested in the yards up to catch receivers this offseason. Well, that is all the news I have for you guys today. If you enjoyed what you saw or heard, make sure to subscribe because I post content like this almost every single day. Thanks for tuning in, and as always, go Jets. See you later.